Well, it was an engagement one teacher from the Kenton School District never expected. Her fiance, who's also a teacher in the district, surprised her with a ring in front of the entire school. Love this story. Twin your sides, Kelly Dudzik now introduces us to the newly engaged couple and finds out what it took to pull the proposal off. My principal came up to me before it all started and said he's going to need some teacher volunteers to do a demonstration on listening in front of the kids at the end. And I was like, okay, I thought we were picking on the new teacher because I just got hired this year full time. So I was like, yep, I'll do it. <laughs> Take off your mask. As soon as I took the blindfold off, Corey was there kneeling and I couldn't think of anything else. It was just like, oh my goodness, what is happening? <laughs> and he asked and I said, I don't even know if I said yes, but it was just like a bobblehead. Uh -huh. <laughs> Second grade teacher Amanda Eichinger and special education teacher Corey Martin met through their best friends watching a Bills game almost four years ago. One graduated from Ken East, the other from Ken West the same year, but they'd never met. Now they both teach in the district and they're engaged. I couldn't have asked for it to go any better. It was literally perfect. Her reaction was priceless and it was all worth the, the nerves but it was it was really fun. Corey started planning the surprise over the summer when he asked Amanda's principal at Edison Elementary if he could propose at school. Only a handful of people knew and they all kept it secret. No one even hinted at it so they're pretty good secret keepers over there. <laughs> While the assembly got underway Corey hid in the locker room with his mom and sister. And we had to sit back there for probably about 25 minutes which was the long, it was about 20 minutes, but it was a long 20 minutes. I, I was pretty nervous back there, to be honest. And my sister and mother found it very funny that I was so nervous the whole time. Amanda and Corey say the reaction from the hundreds of students who saw it all happen was priceless. It was kind of a delayed reaction throughout the kids because they're just so young, so they don't really understand the whole concept of it. But they thought we got married yeah. So. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> on the spot. Yeah. Any advice for people who are planning on popping the question? <laughs> Any advice? Um, no. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> no, it's enjoy the whole process. And it, it was fun and it's nerve wracking, like I said, but it was well worth it in the end. So enjoy it. I loved it. Thanks. Good job. <laughs> they plan on getting married on Memorial Day weekend in 2020. In Kenmore, Kelly Dudzik, Channel 2 News. That is priceless. She did kind of look like a bobblehead. <laughs> she did. Really she knew it. <laughs> it's cute, though. Good luck to both of you. Yeah, very creative. Yeah, I like yeah. that. That's